Medical experts have long considered swimming a great exercise and therapy for people. So why not for dogs too? That's exactly what's happening at a place called the Barkatorium. In this special report, Newswatch's Megan Culture takes us to the Glen Burnie business to find out how water is helping dogs get back on their feet. Meet Gus. Once a week, you'll find him here, getting suited up for his weekly dip in the pool. The 11-year-old Scottish Terrier was a rescue from Illinois, adopted by Angela Martin a few years ago. We noticed right away that he wasn't walking properly. He had really no strength left in his legs at all. A vet confirmed that the injury was in his back. Two of his spinal discs were sitting higher than the others. Not knowing the dog's history or how to treat his injury, a friend recommended she take him to the Barkatorium, a water therapy facility just north of Kingston. We thought, well, we'll try it and see. It's, it's good for humans, so it, it's got to be good for, you know, dogs as well. It's a business that Rick Bags and his wife Diane opened up a year ago after taking their dog to a similar facility in Toronto. I had noticed that they offered a course on uh, hydrotherapy up in Ottawa at uh, K9 Water Wellness, so I went up there and took the course and I really enjoyed it. So I thought that would so be something I would love to do. He installed this indoor heated saltwater pool in his home and began administering therapy for dogs recovering from injuries or surgery. It's also ideal for exercise and weight loss when walking isn't an option. Well, there's less stress on, uh, on the muscles and the, the water pressure uh, helps to uh, stimulate uh, blood flow. For Gus, getting in the water helps increase muscle mass in his legs without putting stress on his back. We try to ensure that he uses those back legs as much as possible. Uh, we put boots on him to, to give him uh, a, a sense of his feet back there and, and you know, get him to move his legs. Since the Barkatorium first opened, it has been able to help nearly 20 dogs as large as German Shepherds and as small as Gus get back on their feet. He's definitely a lot stronger. He walks a lot better on walks. He doesn't, when he falls over, he gets up quicker. And to see the dogs uh, improve and to hear the feedback from their owners that, uh, you know, they're getting more excited, they're able to navigate the, the stairs, play around the house or play out in, uh, at the dog park or in the yard, you know, that's, that's the best uh, reward for me. Megan Coulter, CKWS Newswatch.